This is his neutral face. Anyway, uh, moving on to the final match. Let's give some ads. Skip ads. Skip ads. Apparently, there was a stream malfunction. Fantastic. Still, do you play Starbo? No. Um, whoa! Okay, this is the start of the game. Okay, I think we're good. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Final match. Mini versus Winner 4, apparently. No, that's not who he's versus. He is versus... This guy! Mini versus Shuttle. Okay, it doesn't look like we missed too much. Apparently there's a stream malfunction on... Whoa! Whoa, we're doing the XP thing! Oh god, oh god, it's the XP thing! This is not me, I swear! You can see my mouse. Apparently we need to resize the screen, okay. I don't know who's who now though, unfortunately. If somebody could tell me who's who, that would be super. Um, well, whoever the red guy is, he's scouting cross map. And whoever the yellow guy is, he's not scouting at all. Wait. Anyway. So until somebody tells me who's who, let me talk about Starbo. Um, I, I don't have StarCraft 2 installed on this computer, but uh, I did have it on my other computer, my old computer. I played through like the HOTS campaign. I did. I played a lot of Wings of Liberty, and then like in HOTS, I just played the campaign and didn't even touch the multiplayer. And I don't know. I've heard some stuff about Sarbo. I'm not particularly interested. It's like I'd much rather just play Brutor. <laughs> I have been playing Brutor. That's what I've been playing that. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I might. I might just try it once, but I'm not. I'm not overly interested. <laughs> um, I'm sure it's a fantastic thing. See, the thing is, like, I, like, like, like the StarCraft Brood War mod thing, the uh, StarCraft 2, excuse me, StarCraft 2 Brood War mod, and Starbo, like, they seem like wonderful projects, and I, I, like, really admire these guys who put so much time and effort into making them, and obviously have, like, mad skills at doing this. Um, it's just that, like, the, the problem is not not even that, you know, it's not good or not fun, but they just, I don't see how they even have a future, you know? And that might seem kind of ironic. Hold on, let me let me just briefly say what's going on in the game. Both players have actually just sent their first cells past each other to go for the attack here. I'm not actually sure how this happened, but you have to see some uh, multitasking micro. It looks like, ooh, not going to get a second probe here uh, for red, whoever red is. By the way, I still don't know who's who. Um, whereas Yellow has also got a kill, but he's also going to lose his L, I think, before getting a second probe. Anyway, the problem with the things like StarCraft 2 Brood War and Starbo is that they're basically just like custom maps slash mods, uh, and with and, and they're officially owned by Blizzard now, right? Because they're made in the arcade. So I don't see how they can event like ever have any possibility of having like big tournaments and things. Because it's not going to be like Dota, where Dota just exploded by itself and was amazing. With Starbo, the thing is, you have to have... To, like, for it to be legitimate, you have to have like pro gamers playing tournaments on it. But I don't see how that's ever going to happen, because Blizzard basically controls all the tournaments and all the games. And they're never going to support something that's not the official ladder version of StarCraft, right? So... Even if Starbo was like the greatest thing ever, Blizzard just because like would just never admit that their version of StarCraft wasn't as good as Starbo and make it official, right? They would just they, just as a company you just can't do that. So so I don't know how it just could ever work, right? So that's that's just my my dismal view on things. But you know I'm a grumpy old man, so just ignore me. I mean I don't even know what the difference between a Nexus and a Gateway is. So what could I possibly know about Blizzard and Starbo, right? Hey, we got DTs from Red. Um, hold on, let me let me let me see in the chat if anybody actually knows who these players are. <laughs> uh, oh, Red Red Shuttle, Red is Shuttle. Okay, Red is Shuttle. All right. So apparently the colors are correct. Okay, fantastic. Um, so we've got DTs against Reaver before Ops. Oh god, this is going to be painful. He didn't get Observatory, did he? Oh my god. Mini, are you just gonna... Are you... Oh my god. Are we just gonna see an instant GG? Oh man, this PvP group, man. Are you serious? Like, two proxy gates, two 12 nexes, all getting smashed. Me not knowing what I'm talking about in the winner's match, and then now like... Or was it losing match? Either way. And then now a final match where it's just like, insta-lose to DTs. 
I mean, I guess if he builds the observatory and the observer builds relatively quickly, yeah, so he's got the observatory on the way now. If he just blocks his ramp, maybe he'll just, like, lose three goons and survive anyway. The problem with that kind of thing is that if he does lose three goons, even if he gets the obs out, he might just die anyway because he doesn't have enough units left. So that would also be bad. Anyway, that's why we've got some uh, micro battle here. Five Dragoons and a Zealot versus five Dragoons and a Zealot. And so it's basically going to be like a micro tournament situation. Who's got who's got the skills, man? Who's got the mad micro skills? Oh no, extra goon introduced. That is unfair. That is clearly against the micro tournament rules. You can't have extra units here. No, 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 no. It's not fair. Oh shit! And now it's the oh shit moment. All right, let's see the oh shit moment. Now he did. Ha he does have an observatory, but I imagine he's building a reaver, so he might cancel the reaver and build. No, he's got the reaver done. Oh, well that's that's good. But where's the observer? Come on, observer, observer. Where the observer? Wow, it's in time. Huh. Okay, so basically those DTs were not the fastest DTs in the world because he built like five goons first. So now Shuttle's all like, huh. Well, now I got these DTs, I'm not going to do anything. So, Mini just has to be careful that if he moves out, he doesn't get backstabbed by DTs and just, like, lose all his probes. Because as long as that doesn't happen... I mean, here's the, okay, here's the thing. He's still not in the best position, because even though he's not going to die to the DTs, uh, Shuttle's getting an expansion, and Mini hasn't got one yet. So, he's just now built his expansion. His expansion is about starting about... When Mini's, uh, sorry, when Shuttle is halfway done. So he still has to do some economic damage at some point uh, to make this good. And notice he's still being very defensive because he knows that, you know, going out and being aggressive right now is not really the best plan because there's a nice defensive advantage here, especially with the bridges, and getting backstabbed by DTs will just instantly end the game. So I think his plan now is to just, especially in these positions, just go for the Reaver Harass to make up for this slightly delayed. Uh, natural expansion. And you can see he's actually already got a shuttle over there because he knows that the goons themselves are enough to hold uh, hold down the fort because shuttle just pulled everything back. I mean, he also saw that with the obs, but I think he could have just sort of surmised that anyway. And, oh man, looks like he's just going to tank a bunch of shots here. He might lose the shuttle though! Oh my god, what are you doing? That was not worth it at all, Mini. That, that seemed to me like an obvious... Uh, he should have obviously pulled back immediately as soon as he saw that, you know, shuttle was constantly targeting the shuttle he wasn't uh you know just a moving his guns and letting them shoot the reaver uh you know whatever you know, however they wanted he, he he was focusing down the shuttle there was no way that was going to get out if he stayed around for the reaver to shoot the scarab that was a huge waste here and that's going to mean that it's going to be really hard now to catch up from this economic deficit because now shuttle's goon count is going to be climbing he's going to have a lot more uh units with which to actually properly defend all the possible harassment routes Really, really, really poor for Mini. Oh man, Mini, Mini, Mini looks so good in the uh, in the first series against Shuttle, and he could just lose now. It'd be it'd be pretty funny too because you know if Mini loses now, he'll be knocked out and Shuttle advance. But you know technically the overall score between the players would be two one in favor of Mini because he won the first two games, so he would have had a winning record against Shuttle and still been eliminated by Shuttle. Ah, uh, it's how the uh, how the group goes, I'm afraid. Oh man, we got more talk of the sale curse. I feel bad for these players to get cursed by casters. Sad times, sad times. It's like, you know, you practice so hard, you train day in, day out, you play awesome games, and in the end your fate is just up to some guy who can't tell the difference between a nexus and a gateway. I mean, life is just so unfair. On the plus side, I'm the guy that, <laughs> that curses the players, so I guess it's, you know... If life's gonna be unfair, you might as well be the guy that, you know, gets the uh, the better end of the stick, I suppose. Ugh, I'm a terrible person. Anyway. So this is why we have an attack coming out. We've got a speed shuttle as well, for Mini. We have no uh, Reavers, of course, for shuttle. He actually just went with the Templar attack. I assume he's getting speed for these Zealots. Uh, he's also got a high Templar. I doubt he'll have Storm in time for this, and he also uh, obviously doesn't have speed in time for this. Oh my god. There's two Reavers here. Oh man, his tech is not ready yet. Oh my god, Shuttle could just die. Oh, but he's got a DT. Is there an OBS? Oh, there's no OBS. Okay, so the DT will keep him alive. Right? Yeah, there's, there's, there's no way Mini can actually break this. Surely. Surely? 
The DT, the DT is not doing enough damage, but it's there. Okay, and Obs is coming out now. There's two Obs here for a shuttle. If he can snipe this Obs from Mini, he can use the DT to keep. Oh my god, the DT died. Oh my god, there's still two Reavers, right? Oh shit, is Storm done yet? If Storm is done, he might live. Oh my god, shuttle. Shuttle! He tried. Oh, he does have Storm! He does! He gets, he gets something! Something died there, but it wasn't a Reaver. Oh my god, even with the storm, he needs another one to kill the Reavers. Oh no, Shuttle! Shuttle! Oh no! Oh man, he is so dead. And I'm pretty confident this time. I said I said Movie was dead against Mini. No! What the hell? The Casticurse! What the fuck? Whatever I say is just gonna be wrong. Oh man, Herb Derp, Minnie's got the game, boom! And the Reavers and the Shuttle are all dead. What is going on? Do you guys see this? Oh my god, this 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 is just uncanny. I mean, this, this is, how can this be possible? Oh man, but 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 it looks like Minnie legitimately has got this though. He's killed the Nexus. Oh thank god. But this this is so creepy though, man. This is weird. Oh man, I, I'm gonna go like see an exorcist or something. I might be like possessed by some evil spirit that just makes, you know, everything I say about a StarCraft game be untrue. God, how terrible would that be? I could try some funny things with it though. Hmm. Oh man. That is just. That is just. Ugh. Anyway. Uh, so, Mini's now got the hard contain on the low ground here. Oh, he's bringing another Reaver in. See, this is the pro. This is why, uh, generally, you. Uh, you see Reavers, you know, early to mid game a lot more than DTs into Templar. Uh, into Templar tech, because Templar tech is just a little bit too slow. And so if you get caught in a position like this, it's just really hard to defend. Because, um, I mean, speed lots and storms are really good, and in the long run, I think they're better than Reavers, but the problem is you just don't have time to get there without dying. Even going DT opening, as, as you know, Shuttle did, he still didn't have time to get his tech up before the Reavers broke down his door. Uh, so, uh... So yeah, that was not good. Also, in these low unit count engagements, it's a little bit easier to dodge storms as well, whereas you can't really dodge scarabs. <clears throat> <sighs> Man, if, if, if Artosis and I cast it together, it would just, could, like, I don't know, I, I would fear the universe imploding or something. Like, the, the players, like, if, if both of us picked a player to root for, the game would just... I don't know, and somehow end up in both players losing. Like, they both get eliminated at exactly the same time, and instead of being a draw, it actually counts as they both lose. Oh, man. That would be pretty awesome if it happened, but... Still. Everyone would be a loser in that case. At least Artosis knows what he's talking about, though. Pretty sure Artosis knows the difference between a Nexus and a Gateway, so... I think I think that would be good. Oh man, we got a big bust out here though. Finally speed did finish. And the goons are trapped! Oh man, this game is not over. It's never over. Because I will just curse whoever is winning the game. Although that did like a lot less than I thought for some reason. Partially because these goons in the Archon were just sitting in the main. Wow, that did absolutely nothing. GG! Shuttle has been eliminated, ladies and gentlemen. Mini! 3-0-ing Shuttle in this group and looking absolutely miserable about it. Um, because, I don't know, I guess he felt my curse. He was like, man, I could have toured the group if it wasn't for that goddamn sale. Ah, whatever, it's fine, man, you advanced, you got it. So, Shuttle, wow, is out. He's out. Round 32, look at that. Man. Man, there's been some crazy eliminations so far. Hold on, oh man, Shuttle looks really sad. 